And that was pretty, pretty amazing and life changing and and still a bit surreal. Earlier this year, Patricia Perko received news that she'd been accepted into the one year teacher training program at Canada's National Ballet School. Remarkably, the 45 year old only started dancing eight years ago. Oh, I mean, when I started, I I wasn't even quite sure, you know, if you could reach a decent level as you know, as someone who started late. Patricia is from Munich, Germany, and moved to Canada five years ago with her son, Finnan. I have a son uh, who's now 15, and uh, he has a disability. I was doing some research, uh, you know, looking into therapies that went kind of beyond the conventional uh, approaches. So I thought, you know what, let's go for three months, give it a try, and, and then we'll see. Um, and then we arrived and I don't know, it was just, you know, the therapies went well, but also just everything felt light and we were so welcome, you know, in Toronto. The ballet dancer admits she's always been athletic, but has never had ballet training prior to this. And in, in one uh, brave day, I, I kind of gave it a try and, and I was hooked ever since, like, if, felt somehow like this was for me now. I continued training. I kind of ramped it up uh, after a while. Like I started um, taking classes pretty much every day. At some point, and because I have a background in, in strength and conditioning coaching and sports coaching and movement education, it kind of felt natural to pass on my learning experiences uh, to other people who started ballet late. Three years ago, she decided to audition for this ballet program and was denied. But this year, that news changed. So two weeks after the audition, which was back in May, I got my acceptance letter, which was um, like, it was, it was a huge surprise. Patricia said that although she has been accepted, she is trying to raise money for tuition and has started a crowdfundme campaign to assist with that. For City News, I'm Stella Quisto.